Hello friends, this is Anand Harsh from Jodhpur. Once again, I'm with you. The new video lecture on inserting data into the tables using Oracle 10G Express Edition. In the past video lecture, we <coughs> discuss on how to create tables. Okay, you are now familiar with the that term you are now familiar with that term. now today we are going to inserting some records into that empty table which can be seen by the describe command you all know about that description desc and then table name that is that uh, command syntax one more thing i have to uh, share with you students uh, that uh, the command the term command and the statement of uh, SQL is uh, uh, used interchangeably that both are the same meaning uh, somewhere it is used command and some uh, where it is used as a statement so uh, if you uh, find, found SQL statements and if you found some SQL commands uh, both are the same okay now we are moving towards inserting records into the table okay first of all uh, we have to check the table name I didn't recognize what was my table name so I have to go to the terminal that is run SQL command line that is a dose based terminal for Oracle 10 G Express Edition. So I have, uh, I must have to connect first and give a username that is system and a password and a password that is uh, my own. I cannot share it with you. And now it is connected. Now I forgot the table yesterday or first in that lecture. I have made so what to do uh, there is a command called <coughs> select star from tab tab is the main database where all the tables like system tables and all the tables which you have uh, do not specify uh, a kind of database data database will be resided here in the uh, database called tab so uh, when we are writing the command select star from tab select means a retrieval statement which will be which we will be discussed in uh, the upcoming video lectures star means all records from uh, a table name tab so it is a, a system table uh, that is uh, having all the table all the tables uh, including the system tables in the central database so we are now clicking the enter button so these are all the tables which we have already created so I got the name that is new table I have created so uh, first of all uh, describe the tables uh, schema so that we will insert accurate data into that uh, described fields okay so the table name is new table so there are four fields we uh, declare roll number as a number two name age and city there get two number two and there get two and five okay so uh, now <coughs> uh, we first discuss the syntax of this inserting records so, uh, there are two syntax we only consider the first syntax here and in the upcoming video lectures we will discuss the uh, second one the first syntax is insert into keyword table name table name and then values then column one value then column 2 value and so on up to 
column and values okay so this is the simple way to inserting record into the table insert the table name values keyword then bracket and column one column two up to column n there may be a multiple columns so the syntax is always universal uh, according to the syntax we can uh, insert any uh, records into any tables okay so uh, we are <coughs> uh, creating the sql statement or command so insert into our table name is new table values keyword then bracket start no spaces there <coughs> column one um, value that is row number that can be one column two is uh, i think name a density name so uh, the string value or character value will be always uh, inserted in, in single quotation marks so i am i am giving avinash the name so it is uh, satisfy the size uh, that is where care two and ten size avinash have one two three four five six and seven characters so it is satisfying that uh, uh, the table is schema so enough is the correct uh, <coughs> value all the columns are column values are separated by the comma separator separator operator or comma operator okay so first value row number is one name is uh, avinas and the age is uh, 27 then uh, the city will be uh, Mumbai okay so uh, the statement will be ended with a semicolon okay you are getting me okay now we are moving towards the terminal we are putting this command here so I'm making possible to see you can see this uh, <coughs> select oh uh, sorry insert into table name is new table then values keyword value and values has some has some difference so you must enter the keyword values and that is one roll number name is avinash then 27h then mumbai Okay, so now we are pressing the enter and message arise that one row data. Okay, so now guys we are familiar with the term inserting record into the tables using Oracle 10 G Express Edition. Okay, now uh, the next uh, step is to retrieve the data inserted into our table. Okay, so the command to retrieve the records from the table okay so index of creating uh, selecting some uh, records from the table is select statement or select command so index is select star from table name Okay, that is a generalized syntax of the selecting statement we can use select star from new table here because we have just entered a record into our table name new table so select star from new table so it will show us the record uh, records which are inserted into our table so now you can see the roll number name age and city in this table so today we consider two commands one is inserting records uh, of basic type second one is discussed in the upcoming video lecture and the second one is retrieving the records from the table the here uh, the star here represents all records that means the roll number will are shown to us name will shown to us age will shown to us 
as well as city is shown to us okay thanks all of you for watching this video lecture and give me a piece of time i hope you will like my video and give some your valuable feedbacks in the uh, comment section i will uh, rejoice with your comments either it is bad or good i that, that will be a uh, helpful for me and please do not forgive to subscribe my channel thank you all of you have a good day